Do statins really only add four days to your life? So this seems to come up a lot. That was based on a study that was published. The authors that published it didn't even agree with the results, but they said if we took a person with very high LDL cholesterol, let's say their LDL is like 120, 130, and we put them on statins for a couple of years, two years, one year, 13 months, five years, whatever it is, and then come off of the statin. They take it and then they stop. How much more lifespan would you add to them? Probably not a whole lot. Imagine you take a lifelong smoker who's been smoking their entire lives, you know, 80 years old, 90 years old, whatever it is. They've been smoking forever. And you're, you're thinking they're probably going to have COPD, probably going to have lung cancer, obviously. What if we told them not to smoke for like one year or two years or five years? You take a smoker who's been smoking since they're 10 or 12 years old. At age 40, they quit for a few years. At age 45, they start back up again. What is the chance that they delayed or prevented that cancer? Not very much. So that's why that study showed that even the author said, you know, our projection model isn't really designed to say how much statins would add to your life if you were on them forever, because atherosclerosis is a lifelong disease process. It's not a 10 minute disease. It's like a, you know, 40, 50, 60 year disease. So that's why that study showed that. You can go to my blog, just search for statins four days or four days, the number four statins and you'll find out more about this and you can read the study and actually read all the bullet points and the graphics that go with it.